Hello again, ladies and gentlemen. I'm Joe Handy, the Android Authority app guy. We reviewed Opera Browser before, but a new update has brought not only a lot of bug fixes, but a brand new tablet UI. In this video, we're going to check that new UI out. Even though there are a lot of changes, many of them are subtle. To start, Opera takes advantage of the increased screen real estate on tablet screens by using a real tab system like you'd find on a desktop browser. This differs from the phone browser, which uses the Chrome-like square with buttons to denote open tabs. Another change you'll notice is the settings menu. Instead of opening the settings to a full screen, you instead get a windowed settings menu that you can click out of without using the back button. It looks nice, and it doesn't make you reach for that back button, and that's a big improvement. Other UI enhancements involve moving as many things to the left and right sides as possible. Adding things to the speed dial is now on the top right where you can get to it using your right thumb. Replacing it on the left side of the address bar where it is on phones is an icon that'll quickly take you to the speed dial. So you can add something to speed dial with your right thumb and then immediately get to it with your left thumb. Aside from moving buttons around the new settings and the actual tabs, everything else remains pretty much the same. Since there is more screen real estate now, the app feels like it makes better use of that space and everything looks more spaced out and comfortable. It does not have that cramped feeling of a phone browser and we really like that a lot. Overall, we like this new UI improvement. It really takes advantage of the space provided by tablets while maintaining a user-friendly interface by putting essential functions within the reach of a thumb. If you're looking for a browser on your tablet, it's definitely worth giving this one a shot. Once again, I'm Joe Hendy, the Android Authority app guy. Feel free to subscribe to our YouTube channel, and if you like this video, check out some of our other ones. You can find a written companion to this video along with the social media links in the video description. Thank you for watching, and have a wonderful day.